Hello, hello, ladies and gentlemen, and Dolger here back again with another Fire Emblem Heroes video. This is Ether Rage Week 76, Day 4. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more daily videos. We're going to meet DJ, and that will do it. DJ finally got us a loss for the week. Unfortunately, it counted. And this is kind of a fluke loss. I'm not sure what to make of this. Anyway, thanks for all the burst of subscription activity yesterday. I don't know what caused it. But maybe it was the begging at the beginning, if you haven't subscribed, to subscribe. So, whatever it was, no one knows. We can only guess. Thank you for the support, guys. At some point, we'll get to 2,000 subscribers and I'll have a party. And we'll throw another fun video. But that, that'll probably take a while at the current pace. Um, yeah, so the fluke here is this tactics room and this panel to stop this dancer and then my rally stop. Yeah, so if I get Fjormed, or, yeah, in this case, a Tactics Room, it really doesn't work. Now, I could bypass this by using Aerobatics. Yes, the answer was Aerobatics, what I forgot yesterday, Azura's B skill. Yeah, I could do that, but then that opens her up for all kinds of baitable opportunities, and I don't want to do that. So I really need to probably replace her with a high HP dancer that's not susceptible to that not a ranged answer but anyway let's see how they beat it pretty standard altina if she can beat the yarn without any follow-up well yeah he had no chance there and with no ability to dance anybody because everybody just rushed past azura hey guys wait for me i'm stuck <laughs> and yes the tactics room is gone but not before it procs so just in case you're aware that procs before that destroys because this is the other turn so it's not even really a question but that's what happens as the blows away color advantaged Olwen with minus speed that makes me really sad are you a bonus unit this week asked I hope so because that makes me sad <laughs> what do you get with Eagle's egg okay you just get some buffs okay they do a pretty masterful job here of blowing away this Duma Getting rid of the other Duma. Repoing out of the way. But the only problem is... The only major problem is... It's game over. And they lost both Ether, DJ. I mean, I gotta get you back. <laughs> I gotta get you back. It's a, it's a murder-suicide pact, I guess. Is that what it is? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> so you're not going to get any ether. I hope uh, that wasn't a double up because you're going to have problems later in the week. You can miss nothing else. So, I don't know. 80 so far. We're on day four. <laughs> Guys, uh, let's single-handedly blame Akuma Rain for today's delay in the video. I don't know when I'm going to be posting this. I'll probably post it at 1 or 2 a.m. Eastern. <laughs> probably. Um... But uh, we're going to fight Kurrigan, and if we can find Mr. Akuma Rain, or Miss, again, I don't know gender here. Um, if you want to be a part of my mock battle series, we're going to use this Altina team today. All you got to do is leave me a comment with your in-game name, what season you want to be fought on, how you want to be fought, and look at more details in the video description to find out how you too can be a part of the fun. My friend code is in the video description notes. Okay, so here's the team. <laughs> it's four Dumas and two tanks. Scores okay. All these Dumas are, are merged. This is very impressive. That's a lot of Dumas to be playing with. And this Rudolph is going to be in my nightmare. He's going to give me PTSD, man. Because, like, he is just... So annoying. We fought this team before. I don't know if we fought it with uh, Astra. So it was nice to be able to play with this. So thanks for coming back and requesting a fight. This is going to require very specific movement. I'm going to try to do the clear first. And I'm going to show you just how gross it is. Because it is very gross. Akuma has built this very well. All these swaps basically make sure these tanks never die. The whole point of these tanks are to never die. This this is a definition of a pretty good stall team. So, I mean, they're going to blow you away with Duma's 
breath or whatever it is. <laughs> and then these tanks are just going to not die. Thornlands doesn't allow you to follow up. So, I mean, no follow up would be very good. So, like, a Hilda would destroy Rudolph, I believe. She'd do a pretty good job. But we don't have Hilda. And we have Arden here with his 91 HP. Guys, you're going to see something you will never see again. I guarantee it. <laughs> I don't make a lot of guarantees, but this is probably something you're never going to see again. I'm going to set up to the right. Did I, did I mention this? It took me an hour and a half. An hour and a half to figure this, this strat out. And it's just because Rudolph won't engage me. He always wants to get away from me and get swapped and get healed. And I just can't stop him because I don't have a green on this team. And none of my tanking teams have any chance of helping here. So, here we go. Altina's going to do it. Altina's going to tank. She got that buff. Home buffs. And here comes a quad Altina. Something you will probably never see in your lifetime. You can tell your grandkids about that. That something took a fully buffed Altina with goads. And it took four attacks <laughs> to knock him out. That's so crazy. Uh, okay. From here. It's very particular what we do now. We have to heal the Sigrun. She's going to be our ticket out of here to get past this Rudolph. Okay. Yeah, we want Altina to get the buffs. So these two need to stick very close together because of Sigrun's home. Our Hone Flyers is going to be very important here. And we're just going to end our turn. If we engage now, there's an Armored Boots, or an Armored March, rather, on Rudolph. If we engage now, it's all over because swaps will happen. And if he ever gets healed, I cannot stop him. So, here's what the epiphany was for me. Using Altina's Death Smoke I have on her C-Skill, it weakens him a bit... We can do this by swapping in. I get a little bit more defense to survive later on. Actually, I don't think that was the case. I had many different iterations of this. She just needs to be in a position to take a wounded Rudolph. Doesn't quite get into Wings of Mercy range. Now, if he did get into Wings of Mercy range, we got all three of these Dumas ready to pounce. <laughs> this reminds me, you guys ever played Legend of Zelda? Uh, what was it called? What was the damn game called? Legend of Zelda uh, Spirit Tracks. You ever play that game and, you know, you're walking through the temple with, like, Zelda? I'm, 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 I'm losing you guys, sorry. We're, like... It's like, it's the main dungeon when you're trying to get to the very top. And there's little sentinels just walk around. And if you, like, get hit by a searchlight, <laughs> they, like, jump on your ass with these wings of mercies. Does that, does that make any sense to you guys? Anybody? Any Spirit Tracks fans out there? All right. Enough. Enough of that. Let's clear this up. Um... Yes, okay, so Averse is going to have to come up here and take a hit from this Duma, because we need to get that Aether, because we really will have, no have not have any other opportunity to do it in the rest of the game, and thankfully this Duma just has uh, Wings of Mercy, and can't double us. I have to do that to weaken him just a bit more, to put him under, was he actually under his special fighter range at this point? I don't know. But he needs to be right now, so I can just barely kill him. Oh no, <laughs> can't do it. But I move over here, I can. I can barely knock the bastard out. Ugh, you have no idea how long it took to stop him. So Akuma Rain, I hope you appreciate <laughs> my efforts to give a clear for you. But we're not out of the woods yet, because you've put these stupid traps all over the place where I can't really move very well. And, well, we can beat the Duma. But is that what we want to do? I don't know. We can beat the Duma with a Naga, so that's not bad. Can we do better than that? We can 
do this. I can't really move. Now you don't you have the hardy bearing, so I can't I <laughs> see. Okay. So you have the hardy bearing, so I can do something like that. No, I can't. Look at that. <laughs> But I think I'll have enough HP to deal with you on enemy phase. So let's see if we can get rid of that Duma on the left. Yep. And then we're just so close to getting that Aether. But we're just a little bit out of range. I've tried really hard to get everything and I just can't do it. If you weren't standing here, I could repo and get you there, but... Yeah, and you're blocking me to try that. So that's the best I got for you, Akuma. Thank you. I, I really had fun doing that, but man, that was difficult. <laughs> Let's go back and just one, look at it one more time, see how it actually performs with a real clear. I could show you how I... I mean, I don't really need to show much. This is so devastating in terms of just all the damage. My healing tower's lost. If I brought anybody else here, this is the only healer team I have. So, there's not much else I can do. So, if you try to go for it, turn one. Explosion. Dead. So, you'd have to have a really, really strong green to kill this Rudolph and make sure he dies. So if we try to go immediately, which you need to in this, this is the stall team. So you have to get book in here. This seems like the trap. So. Ah, yeah, I didn't want to do that. I mean, if I did something stupid, like put an Altina here, I think she might survive this. Like, barely? Nope. <laughs> Never mind. What I wanted to show here, basically, it doesn't really matter, but just pretend he didn't die. Yeah, this Rudolph basically, with treats, gets back into the healing tower, and I have no way of getting him. Very well done. You know, Arda does something very similar if you don't knock him out. So, I like everything you're doing here. It's a very effective stall team. I don't really appreciate stall teams very much, but you've done a good, do a good job there. You did good, good job there. <laughs> I can't speak. You've broken me, Akuma. Uh, <sighs> okay. Uh, next up is a blind version of Kurrigan. I have no idea what I'm getting myself into. My mind is already gone. So let's do it, guys. Let's do it. I'm probably going to pause this. Because I, I don't know. If you want me to ramble on, I'm just going to be broken. Oh, it's my team again. What is this? <laughs> This is my old my old map setup with Death Knight. All right, let me think about what I want to do here. Let's meet the teams at least, and then I'll think about it. We got two scoring units, Leaf and Thorsir. I'm gonna give it three attempts, and I'm gonna quit. We got Death Knight, all one, and Alm. Alm with a hardy bearing. Well, that's a bummer. Alm with a hardy bearing is a bummer. Hmm. Hmm. All right, I don't want to think. I'm going to give one strike immediately and just go this side. How did this work again? I mean, so this is normally my lave spot. It's a rally trap, so rally, and then you go, and then it's, there's no lunge or anything like that. Okay. How did, what did I do over here? I'm so broken, I don't even know what I just did. Ah, I probably should not have broken that. Jeez, I forgot. This is a speedy death knight, isn't he? Did you have like, you have, yeah? You got to push kill him. This is too much speed. <laughs> why is why is death knight so fast? Lull speed. Okay, so yeah, you can't tank that. That's a bad idea. We'll call that strike one. Is there anything else really I could do there with the tank? Not really. I mean, maybe. Nah. 
Sigrun can't take both of these two. I mean, I like seeing a fellow Olwen user, so. Oh, you put some cash on this Olwen. Oh, okay. I see what you're doing here. Good job on the skills. Oh, yeah, I just don't think this is going to be tankable. It's a rally trap on both sides, so I'm going to use one of my remaining attempts to try to do this with, let's say... You see, my, um, my Micaiah doesn't have close counter, so that's out as a potential hit. She might be able to stop them? I don't know if she'd be in vantage range or she could take one hit at least. It's an interesting, I mean, maneuver if I could have that Micaiah with close counter, but we don't have that. So let's try this. I can at least shut down something maybe? No, probably not. Can't shut down that rally because that's too much HP. Ah, I can't shut down the Azura though because I just have enough HP this week. Okay. Okay, that's something. That's something. <laughs> So I should be able to stop the rally trap, correct? Fjorm's here stopping the dancer. Don't really need more attacks, so who do I want to target next? I got panicked. That's not good, because I think I actually had a buff on. Okay, so I did shut down the dancer again, so that's good news. Are you, Are you gonna outspeed me? Probably. Jeez, that's gonna be in the mid fifties, and I get a lull. But if I have some dancers here, maybe I'll be able to to deal with that. In Wings of Mercies, yeah. I don't know if I'll put him even close to Wings of Mercy range. I just need Altina to get over here as fast as possible. <laughs> You don't have killing intent on. Ooh. Well, that's good. So I could blow her away with Altina. Can I get her over there? I don't think so. Maybe? Okay. I can try. Let's see what Altina's got. Just too damn fast. That stupid horse, man. <laughs> it's too fast. I should be able to knock this left side out. No, because yeah, enough for Wings of Mercy range. Oh, what a pain. What a pain. With Hardy Bearing, I'm kind of screwed here. Let's see if we can at least get it clear. I should be able to stop. No, no, no. I might be dead here. Nope, not dead. Good. Not dead. Not being not dead is always good. Nope, but I don't think I can beat all. Because I have no more positioning maneuvers to get over there. I'd have to just do something like this to kill myself just so I can beat him. But then can we beat Death Knight? I just want to win! Okay, he did go the right way. Let's find some freaking happiness up in here. We can't do it! <laughs> Okay, so, uh, yeah, I can't avoid this because he's just going to go around me. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty much dead here. Why won't you die? 69, nice. Oh, I, what a had miracle. It's close. All right, so there's something around along that line. I just cannot have Death Knight hit me at all. So... Now that we've figured out that I'm not going to die from that, should I just go this way? Maybe have Olwen play with Aversa? But I might need Aversa's help for attack. I feel like another strike is going to happen here. Didn't get buffed, so I could have Sigrun help Altina. Let's see what happens when we just have neutral attack. There's the rally. It's not going to matter. Didn't kill me. Okay, that's not good. 
Uh, why does everybody have Wings of Mercy? <laughs> okay. Alright, we'll just try that again, but we won't, you know, do that part. Can we outspeed you reliably? Uh, nah, I don't think so. I don't know how we're gonna be the Death Knight. I don't. I don't know yet. Oh crap! Fjorm's gotta stay in that lane. Otherwise, this is gonna be bad. Maybe not. That should be a rally and then a dance and then I think a Versa might be able to do this because. Unfortunately, Altina can't get there. Are you well? With utter I don't know if I wanted to heal there. Ah, uh, you're going to be a Wings of Mercy from Alm now, so I'm screwed. Yeah. Alright, I see you, Kurrigan. What I'm going to do... I've never done this before... So I think I've got an answer here. Give me a few moments. We'll call this a blind plan. So gone some, through some iterations. Uh, I'll give it a couple minutes, see if I can find a solution. There's something here to stop the Death Knight. And I think I can clear this with Altina. So, all right. It, which would make sense because Fjorm really screws up this my team. Which is, this is basically a, a more dangerous version of my Altina with this very speedy Death Knight. So, all right, stand by. Be right back. All right, I'm back. <laughs> it took a little longer than I wanted, but I've got a solution. I've got a pure win here. Okay. I could not tank this side. It just didn't work because Death Knight just gets in the way. I can beat him if I can clobber him by himself with this bolt tower, and here's how I did it. I'm going to set Daltina up to the right. I'm going to break some stuff. It's very important the Sig Run gets this Fjorm buffs next turn. Now, I've shut down this dance for this turn. Next turn, we actually want her to dance. Death Knight goes the wrong way. Oh, wait, what? Ah. <laughs> okay. okay, 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 okay. I'll call that strike two. I don't think I ever set Fjorm to set the right... Uh, <laughs> to stop the dance. Alright, let's try that one more time. Gonna come over here with Altina. We're going to... Throw you over there. And that will do it. Let's try it again. Fjorm is correctly taking on Azura now. Same thing, except this time Azura is not going to dance. The Death Knight over on the right side. We get him out of the way for a bit. Which is nice. Get him cleared off. If I didn't have this hone on Fjorm, I can't beat the Leaf. It's just barely get some overkill there. And as luck would have it, without killing Intent, we can actually get rid of this Thrasir on enemy phase. I'm going to have Altina come over here to try to get closer to that Aether. Move all the way to the right. I think I want to go down, actually. To give Fjorm some more buffs there. We can one-shot the Thrasir. And this is what I want. I want Death Knight on turn three to come at me. Get hit. Yeah, I don't think I wanted a, Z a Versa here necessarily. But I can beat him with Naga now. I don't... Yeah, this should be okay. I just need some help to take this Alm on. He's got Hardy Bearing. Don't care about the panic. Take the hit. Blow him away. And now we're left to this Dancer. Where I can get that Aether. Altina can get that next turn. We can actually bait you. Maybe not. I might have too much speed, and I might kill her. 
So let's just wait a minute. She might go right, though. Okay, she didn't. Good. Is it going to be enough? I sure hope so. <laughs> I sure hope so. All right, Kurgan, there you go. I, that's a blind run. You beat me. There's no way I would have beat that. It took me like 10 more attempts. So, Fun team. Man, whoever made that template is a pretty good guy. That guy should get a million dollars. That was me. All right. Um, you've, much, you've been much improved on my uh, map template, though, so... That's gross. Yeah, I, the only way I got that to work was some misdirection with the rallies, and without, without a few worm there, that's tough. I mean, that, that's I mean I can attest to that. The only time anybody really beat me up too badly without like a pure gale force strat with that sort of setup is uh, with Fjorm. So that weak is clearly weak against Fjorm, as all rally trap teams are. But. Man, that really put the pressure on me in the back line. <laughs> it's so claustrophobic back there. All right. Um, I think we're still making good time. Um, going to do this new banner. <laughs> Look at that. As luck would have it, Yarn's here. Marita's here. I'm not a fodder guy, guys. I never have been. Um, I prefer new units or buffing the units I have with, like, a plus one merge. If I get a bunch of greens, I will pull them, but I didn't, so let's just pull this one green. I would really like to have Yarn to have a friend, so he won't be extinct, you know, you have a buddy, and then he can get rid of him. <laughs> but it's Nino. Okay, should we, should we, you only live once this and try to get that Marita? I would like to. Yeah, sure. Why not, guys? I'm happy to spend four orbs when you have a pretty good chance at a really good unit. I like when there's smoke. But that's a Henry. And no dice today, but uh, it's okay. We had... We gave it our best shot. I'm still trying to slowly creep up back to a thousand orbs. If you saw my last summoning session, it didn't go so well. So I'm saving up for airs and... Maybe Altina's and some of the Mythics. It's really, it's all about Mythics, guys. If you want to score well in this mode, which is, this is basically the end game, you got to get your Mythics, and you have to pick and choose your battles of what you want to pick up. I tried to go for Marth. I failed. It happens. Let's do it, guys. Here's today's fight. You've already seen a bunch of Altina. I'm hoping we don't have to see Altina again. I hope so. He's been really tough week. Oh, it's another Duma. It could be it could be awful. It's a plus four Duma. It's probably awful. It's a Japanese guy. That's three strikes. What do we got? Okay. Eh, it doesn't look too bad. It doesn't look too bad, honestly. When I see a archer, I'm not scared. Even though that's a a lull. What lull is that? Is that defense? Okay, renowned bow, more defense loss. I don't know, Gordon. I just think I got your number, buddy. I just think I got your number. Raven's here with Gale Force. Uh, we, but we can bait this way? It's a Micaiah, though. It is a Micaiah. I mean, I would like, like to get rid of her now. That would be nice. Who's got the hardy bearing? Nobody has a hardy bearing who has wings of mercy one two two just two wings of mercy there's no ground orders here because there's no flyers uh okay so seer do you have any way of getting to me no if i can take this micaiah hit and the reinhardt hit I should be in good shape. Now, this Ryan doesn't have special activated. There's no Hector here. There's no Quick and Pulse. So, I should be able to take that. What are we going to get chill-wise? Is there a chill res anywhere? I don't see any. There's a level 6 Dark Shrine. That's going to hurt. Kane is going to take that. She is going to get that bond with her A slot. But she's not going to get a Moonbow off. That's the thing. If Makaya doesn't have her special... Kane can take it. We do have to make sure we don't get hit by this uh, 
Duma 7 damage, though. Because we have the ability to go right now. I'm not sure I want to. But I think we can. I don't like to underestimate Micaiah. I guess Gordon's there, too. I'm, I'm just really not even considering him a threat. Maybe I should. Again, guys, if you look at the defense I have with all the distant defense, I'm in the 80s, aren't I? <laughs> Let's do a defense check. We cut 8. 14. 18. So the 18 from there is 75, and then Corn's going to be adding more. 79. 83. 87 defense. 87 defense. I don't know, Gordon. I don't think you've got what it takes, buddy. 87 defense. Oh, man. Ah, screw it. I'm just going to go for it, man. Just don't want to get caught up over here. But the dancer will be gone. And we will have this raven. Hmm. Who is going to outspeed me? Who's taking the raven down? That's something we should talk about. Say I come here. Micaiah should go first. She should do the most damage. Okay. She dies. I would assume next is Ryan. Ryan goes. I don't know if I'll be in vengeful range. I might not actually be in vengeful range to be able to beat him. But I will probably have enough enough default speed to naturally double him because I'm going to get an extra, I don't know, seven or eight. So it doesn't even matter. Any specials we've got? Is that a drive defense? Yeah. That's not going to save you. That's not going to save you. I just don't want to mess with the Raven because Raven does a decent amount of damage. He will, he will get Gale Force off. Maybe he'll just die. I could just come here and have him die. You can't jump. <laughs> it's such a gamble to go for it right now. I'm feeling it. Indeed. Here comes the seven. Here comes the Micaiah. Oh, there's a rally. Only 25. I didn't even see the rally on Gordon. One damage. I did get the natural double off. And now these greens will go down. What are they going to do? Oh, it's a rally. Okay. Did get some res so we can go after you. If you hit me, what happens? You don't have a Wings of Mercy. All the Wings of Mercies are gone. So that's nice. I'm not going to get debuffed, so I should actually just beat her up. And then the Gordon should fall, because Gordon will have no one to rally. So I'm guessing it's this here, and then Gordon right there. And then Raven will come on down, and we'll get that one. And then we'll try to get that in the corner somehow. That's going to be challenging, especially with no ranged units this week. <sighs> okay. I think I'm just going to stay over here. All right. what is, your desire? is there any way they can break through that and then hit me? Again, there's no ground orders. You don't have boots. These two should be vulnerable now. There are no more Wings of Mercies. I'm going to keep chipping away on this side because we need to make progress. Well? Send Sigrun over here to get that. And then what do we do with you, Naga? Maybe we want to smite somebody? Maybe we keep Raven alive. I don't know how that's going to work, though. But if we keep Duma alive, he's protecting this side. I don't know yet. Hmm. Well, that's a safe move, I think. Alright, they did both go. Good. But Gordon looks like he's not going to fall, so that's something. You should, though. Oh, you survived with 1 HP. What happened? What did you have to survive with 1 HP? How did you do that? How many merges are you? 
You should have died. <laughs> I don't know how you lived. Okay, well, Sigrun's gonna continue her job. I guess we have to sit here for these to go away. Yes. And we'll need to get in position with Raven. He is getting chill sped now. From the Naga. Bolt tower went off. These two should go away now. Can I break this? No, I can't move. I can't do anything. Do I want to swap in any way? I could put corn over here if I wanted to. I'm guessing he's going to be the one that has to take Raven down. Yeah, I think I'm going to do this, a swap, so I can just be in a better spot where I can smite and get to him. I don't need to transform from here on out. They're not going to get healed. Let's do that. I can't do anything else. <laughs> Was that a bonfire? That did, that did three damage. Okay, and maybe it is Raven that's going to be the last one alive. Will he break that thing? Uh, 46. He's going to double me. He's going to double me. Feels like we should just play with the Raven. But I just don't want this Sigrun to get stuck. Now, he is going to be chilled the whole rest of the way. Really getting messed up. Who's giving the four on him? Oh, I was I think it was uh, <laughs> a parting gift from Thrasir when she died. I always forget she debuffs her friends. But that should still occur from this Naga. Are you well? So again, Sigrun's A slot is steady posture, 47. Indeed. I think she can take a hit. Yeah, I could actually break that. Start bringing corn over. I'll hit him. It's reasonable. I think I've got to stop the not. Oh, whoa! Never mind. I can't. <laughs> I was gonna say. Okay, I'm gonna beat Duma real quick. Oh wait. Uh, I can't. Okay. Well, I guess Kane still got a job to do. 58 attack. He's got a brazen attack, so that's gonna be more attack. 65. If foe's HP is less, gets more attack. Great, he's getting a lot of attack. He's getting 7, 13, so that puts him at 71 attack. He's going to hit my res. Ah, that's like not good. <laughs> I think he might kill me. Um, I have no way to hit him either. He's doing 42 damage against this Naga. Well, just based on the math there. I have less res, so... Well, okay. I... I this isn't good. <laughs> this, this is a vantage there. Alright, I'm going to take a pause and see what I can do. Alright, I don't have an answer yet, but at least I'll... I'll talk out my thoughts. If I don't go for this right now, I don't know how I'm going to get it. We don't have that much time left, and if I start screwing around down here, it's off the table. So maybe I should just give up? It seems like the only person that can do it reliably is Corrin, but I'm going to need him here. And I don't know if Raven will break that thing. I don't know. And if I go for it now, who's going to save Sigrun at some point? Yes. It has to be Corrin. So if I could heal up, I just, I think I ran the numbers right. Doom was going to one-shot Kane. Unless Corn helps him. It's really, Corn's the bottleneck. I need him over here, and I need him over here. 40. I can stop the double if I just bring Kane down, but again. Man, Vantage Duma really screwed me. I thought that was going to be a slam dunk. KO, I never even looked at the Vantage. 
uh, it's doable. I just I can't do it at the moment. How could we get Corrin to come back? I just want to put him right there to beat the Duma. And then... We could reposition him back to this spot. But if Raven starts breaking stuff... I can't save Sigrun. I don't think she can take two hits from him. It's a speed... Okay, it's a speed flashing blade. I don't think you'll get it, because I'll get 47, so... Is it a, just a pure check, or is it one? Okay, it's just one above. I just don't want to die. <laughs> I think losing 40 ether might be preferable to not getting the pots. I don't know, I haven't made up my mind. Man, I just there's no easy answers this week. Okay, here's something we could do. You will get the Gale Force off. You know, I could come up, I could swap, I could come down, and then I could smite. Raven shouldn't die, but I believe he'll get Gale Force off. That doesn't sound good. That doesn't sound good. Damn it, Duma. Why you gotta ruin everything? This is easy. I just beat you, I wait for Raven, and then it's done. Okay, I think I'm gonna head fake the Duma. That's one or the Raven. I'm gonna come down here, just sit here. He shouldn't break that, and if he does break it, I'll be safe for one more turn. And by that time, hopefully, Corn can finish up what he was doing on this side. I'm not getting Dragon Boost with Corn, but I'm not gonna need it. That Duma's almost dead. He's not gonna be able to one shot me. All right, here I go. This is my answer. I'm gonna put Corn up here to take care of the Duma. Kane's gonna get healed. And we're gonna do that now. And then, I'm, like I said, I'm gonna head fake Sigrun down. Raven should come straight down. Straight down, buddy. Straight down. Okay, there he is. Did get hurt though. Uh, I'm only gonna do five damage. He's gonna do 31 on me, but not really. He'll do a little bit less. I just don't want him to get that gale force off. <laughs> I think he's going to. <laughs> this didn't quite work out because I don't know. How I'm gonna get him? It's the same problem I had before. I maybe I just need to chase him with Naga. I think this Naga's gotta go up. Naga's gotta go up to secure that. From here, I have to get it. I have a smite here to chase him down. I just can't escape him. That'll give him Gale Force. I can't do that. He's going to go after Sigrun. I don't know how to stop this. He's going to kill me. He's going to kill me. <laughs> Unless I can kill him right now. Yes! Oh, I somehow managed to get Corn up there and down there in like three turns. Or two turns. Unbelievable. Smite saves the day. All right. Ugh. What a week. What a week this has been. These these episodes have been so long. I don't know if you guys like that or you don't. I'm trying to I'm trying to be, make these lean and have them be about 30 minutes, but jeez, I've had to really think. 
suppose you have that when you have no ranged bonus unit. What's up with this, IS? If you don't have leaf, I got nothing. I didn't pull Bram. I failed on Bram. I didn't really try that hard. I failed on leaf multiple times. I didn't go for S, so... Anyway, let me know how your week's going. It sounds like from the comments, overall, it's been a, a hellscape for most of you guys. Ugh. We'll resume tomorrow for day five. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.